the connection between companies like BlackRock, ESG scores, and people's retirement accounts like 401ks. Explain to why that's explain to us why that's important and why people really do need to pay attention. Well, the pension funding laws in the United States are very specific and highly controlled by the government because they don't want companies and boards raping the pension fund to the detriment of retirees in the future. So that funding policy is very, very carefully constructed. When I was on the board of directors, Snap-on Tools, Nick Pinchuk was vigilant in making sure we followed the rules and regulations perfectly because we had a fiduciary duty to the retirees to protect their future. And when you get large organizations like BlackRock to control $10 trillion worth of those kinds of funds, among other things, they're in a situation where they can put a lot of pressure on boards of directors to behave certain ways in, the, in, in speaking with the voice of all their uh, clients. I don't think that's good. I think the individual in those funds should be able to vote their own shares of stock and have their own voice. Uh, you know, a long time ago, Milton Friedman, the great Nobel laureate in economics, um, I had lunch with him in San Diego, and he, and I was a young executive at McDonald's. We were at Coke McDonald's function, and he said, uh, "Young man, I want you to know," and I was forty some years old at the time. <laughs> I want you to know that it is not your province to decide how to spend the shareholders' money. You make a good profit, you give that profit to them. They then in turn can pick and choose what they want to give their money to if they want to at all. They get to pick their charities, their, their social activity. That's not your duty. So your duty is to make profit and let them spend the money wisely. And I really subscribe to that because that's actually, in fact, true. If a board of directors, let's take Disney as the example, they decide that they're going to get into CRT and wokeism and all the rest of those buzzwords of today, and it has a detrimental effect on the company and has a detrimental effect on the investors and it has an effect on the retirees because all of a sudden they could outlive their retirement funds and i have friends yeah. right now that are school teachers that tell me they're scared to death they're going to outlive the retirement funds because the funds have been mismanaged 